Hey, this is Frank Hartman with the Hartman Law Firm, and I'm a practicing attorney in Charleston, South Carolina, specializing in auto accidents and personal injury. Today, we are going to be looking at the issue of distracted driving, specifically the idea behind Bluetooth or hands-free telephones. A lot of you, much like myself out there, you know, we use the Bluetooth and we use the hands-free, and we essentially think that, you know, washes away the sin of driving uh, while we're talking with the telephone. Studies have shown that Bluetooth driving or hands-free driving, whichever way you want to refer to it, is actually just as bad as regular distracted driving. You are four times more likely to be in a car wreck if you have been or, or are, are currently distracted while you're driving. The average time that you take to look down at your phone when you're, you know, say texting or whatever, is roughly five seconds. You are going to go the length of a football field without actually looking at the road in that period of time if you're traveling at 60 miles an hour. It's not just Bluetooth or hands-free that we're talking about. We're also talking about GPS. You know, you're listening to Siri or you're just, you know, your generic GPS machine. You're trying to figure out where you're going and you're looking at it maybe on your telephone. You're not really thinking anything of it and then before you know it, you've driven into the back of someone or they've driven into the back of you. Other ideas or, or concepts that, that come to mind would be simply talking to someone who's in the passenger side of your car or fiddling with the radio, which these are, you know, classic instances of you being distracted while driving. The simple takeaway is, is this. Distracted driving is distracted driving. Don't do it. I can tell you that I have changed my own behavior. If I'm gonna take a phone call, I need to respond to a text or an email or something like that, I will pull over to a rest area or on the side of the road and take care of it if it's something that needs my attention at that particular moment. I would encourage you to change your behavior too because this is something that we need to eliminate from our roads. I'm Frank Hartman with the Hartman Law Firm, and today we talked about distracted driving, what it is, and why you shouldn't be doing it. If you have been involved in an automobile wreck and you need to speak with a good lawyer, call me at 843-300-7600, or feel free to look me up at thehartmanlawfirm.com. Thank you for watching.